everyone, welcome back to Pretty in Pink Mama. We're gonna take a look today at the Jujube BFF in Pinky Square print. I'm gonna give you a look inside the bag without anything packed in it and a tour of all the pockets and features so you can really see what this bag is all about. First things first, whenever I see Pinky Swear or I think of the Jujube Pinky Swear, all I hear in my mind is Pinky Swear, Pinky Swear. So now when you see Pinky Swear, I want you to think of it, Pinky Swear, because it just sounds like a chant to me. I have no idea why. Going right into the mommy pocket, you are gonna find four very functional and useful pockets. Here we have the zipper pocket. I put things like hair ties, rubber bands, bobby pins in there. In this open pocket, I'll keep like my lip gloss and Altoid. On the opposite end, we have the soft case for sunglasses, which I use for highlighters and pens. And of course, one extra pocket, you could put things like a smaller packet of wipes or something like that. I carry a long, chunky wallet, and I just throw that right in the middle there and then zip up this whole section. Here we have a smaller zipping pocket. I carry an iPhone 6 and it fits in there just fine. You could also put things like car keys or things that you wanna grab really fast but you don't want falling out of the bag there. Moving on to the side, these two bottle pockets have an elastic at the top so there's not a flap over it like on the Be Prepared. And these really work well to keep your bottles or sippy cups or whatever you have in there hot or cold, whatever the temperature is. So the bag does come with this really cool messenger strap that you can attach to the D-rings and use as a crossbody or over the shoulder if you want. Moving on to the back. When you order the BFF, it does come with two backpack straps, so you don't have to pay extra for those, and they're really great. They have a lot of padding, they're great quality, the stitching is awesome, and obviously they match the print of the bag, which is a really cute feature. It's going to be a nice accent in front when you wear this hands-free. These backpack straps do have hooks so you can take it off the back. In the back, you also have this nice long pocket where I love to put my life planner. A lot of people might put their iPad in there and it does come with the changing pad. Even though these retail for around $20, when you buy the BFF, this comes with the bag, so I love that. It's got that beautiful memory foam that's nice and soft for baby, light on one side and patterned on the other. Don't forget, this is really easily machine washable so you can change baby with no worries about if this is going to stay clean for the long haul. Moving on to the inside of the main portion of this bag. I don't know the official name, but it's got kind of like an accordion pocket, so it's not just limited to this and you have to shove your hand inside, right? It really opens up. You have the nice lining inside. This bag comes with silver. Two useful zipper pockets right here. I can fit about my whole hand in there. Not super huge pockets, which is great so that stuff won't get lost in there. I think they're very functional in size. And then in front of those two zipper pockets, you have two more pockets. These are really great in size and really can open up. On the sides of the inside, there are two bottle pockets or cup holders or whatever you wanna call them. You'll fit a full bottle and same goes for the other side. On the opposite side, this is the inside of the front portion of the bag. So we have a nice long pocket. This is perfect for baby wipes, diapers, maybe your long wallet, something like that. Then you have these two spaces a lot of people might use for a picture, emergency contact or allergy information, but a little pro tip. This is the small piece from the Legacy First Lady B set and it fits really well inside that little spot. It sticks out just a little bit but you can easily still zip up this whole section. I'm gonna give you a look inside the bag so you can see it's extremely spacious. This is not as big as the Be Prepared. A lot of people compare these two bags and I know they're debating between which ones to get but to me they're totally different. If I was gonna compare, I would compare this maybe to the Be Right Back backpack. I bet you're just thinking right now of all the things you can store in here. You're like, I want that bag. Yeah, so this is the BFF in Pinky Swear. Up, oh, Pinky Swear, Pinky Swear. Also wanted to point out that this print comes with the silver zipper pulls, so if you're not really into the gold accessories like some of the other lines, this is a great choice for you. Anytime you buy a luxury bag and it comes with these kind of feet, I just love that. That's such a great feature because when you put this down on the ground, this kind of raises the bag a little bit so it helps it not get dirty. So I really appreciate that. Thank you, B for the feet. Whoop, whoop, whoop. So that's everything. Now you've seen the B BFF in Pinky Swear. Pinky Swear! Pinky swear! My name is Pinky and I don't swear, but when I intertwine, I'm a pinky swear. Okay, that didn't rhyme, but it still felt good to get it out. This is definitely a statement piece, a really fun pop of color, and if you have any questions about this bag, comments, or topic requests, please leave them in the comments below. Please subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you back next week.